what's up guys uh, Brandon here I'm um, looking at the new 3d printer I got all set up here um, already got a Jeep grill on there yeah um, this is like a little a grabber or something I'm making for my boy here it's all integrated and just already you don't have to do any gearing or anything it just automatically works um, it's like a little three-piece grabber you can see the see that you put your fingers in back there and you pull it backwards or whatever and this thing like comes forward and snaps anyways and then I have another tool kit, uh, tool kit thing for the Ender 3 that kind of hangs off the back up here. And it, it comes with a lot of tools. The Ender 3 will come with a lot of tools brand new. And you just put your tools back there, which is kind of neat. I'm using this 3D Solutec printer filament. This is PLA. It's a silver scale. It's a silver kind of version of PLA. PLA is cornstarch. Um, so it's, it's pretty safe and for the environment and for your kids and everything like that. So, um... I'm trying it out and see how strong it is. I use I got a lot of ABS, I got some ASA, things like that. There's all different kind of filament you can use for these machines. Long story short is I'm doing it because of the Jeep, obviously this isn't a Jeep video. Um, you can make all kind of Jeep parts, all kind of ram mount parts, uh, all kind of you know uh, accessories, roll bar mounts, things like that for the Jeep. Um, that uh, it's either pretty pricey when you start adding them all up or you know, it's just fun. It's it's fun making your own stuff and kind of getting out there and seeing what's possible um, as far as uh, modifications are, are concerned. This is kind of cool. This is like a, you know, the, the Ender comes with a fan right at the bottom. So you got a lot of crap that falls in there. Um, so this was a design by somebody on Thingiverse. Um, a little, it does not seven slot, but you can still tell it's Jeep related. And it kind of covers this up. It bolts to those screws right there. I literally just, these are my first prints. You know, I'm just using this machine now and... and and, uh, you know, I didn't even finish the test dog. This is like your test dog when you first get it. I didn't even finish that. Well, I didn't even finish that crap because I wanted to get on the Jeep stuff. <laughs> but, yeah, that's kind of what it, you know, that's what it's supposed to look like. Super smooth. Look how smooth that is. Let's see if I can get to focus. Look how smooth that is. This is PLA, too, by the way. Anyways, I didn't even finish that because I wanted to get onto the Jeep stuff. Um, and just building modifications for this guy, for this device. For the, for the printer so um yeah that was one of my first ones very cool design you gotta clean it up a little bit but and the bolts are right there so it just slides onto this section here and guard fan so it's kind of kind of like a jeep theme <laughs> going on i like this printer because it's all buildable it's all you know it's like modular it's kind of like a lego it's kind of like a, a jeep itself so i, I kind of like that option to upgrade everything so um yeah it's very easy to learn um, get online, check them out, Ender 3. Get online and check out this 3D Solutec. Um, their filament is pretty nice. I'm using it now. You can tell it's just, it's, it's pretty smooth. Heats really well. I mean, look at the, look at the edging on that thing. You don't see any of that crap line stuff, you know, um, that uh, everybody's kind of used to seeing with 3D machines. It's pretty smooth. And I'm printing three things at one time here. He's printing on the tool, tool kit over there now. Doing down there. I was going back to work on this guy. Here's the Jeep. I'm, I'm afraid to move this because it's not done yet. I think he's going to finish it off here. But pretty neat. He's got to fill in those gaps on the uh, on the grill. See, it's kind of like not finished. It has to fill that whole top piece up. Kind of going to round it off. But it prints in layers. I'm printing all three items at one time. So it's going to go around and print in layers for each thing. See, it jumps from item to item, which is cool. Instead of printing one at one time, it, it looks, you know, does a later version of it. Anyways, I <clears throat> want to thank you guys for looking. Uh, hey, please subscribe down there. I'm going to do a lot more 3D videos, um, especially Jeep-related items. So whenever I'm making these things, I can kind of show them to you, um, show you what I'm doing, install, review, things like that. So uh, subscribe down there. Please hit that bell and notify. Um, let me know if you guys want me to print something. We can check it out or something maybe I could possibly make. I'm kind of getting into that, too. Um, so uh, appreciate your time. And thanks everybody. See you guys. Peace. You get clean to this. <laughs>